Hi everybody, welcome back. This is going to be a thrifty goodness haul. Yes, it is. So thank you so much for coming by my OGs, my new people, my regulars. I really do appreciate it. Um, I got, I went to, where did I get this? I got it from Hooks and Hangers. So apparently there's two Hooks and Hangers. I went to Hooks and Hanger 1. I haven't been, I've, I have driven past with my family, past the Hooks and Hangers number two, Okay, I have because we um we often go to you know where they have the farmers market, so we do see it and we pass by it. Or um, when we're driving down that area, you know, you know to to do what we need to do heading towards California and stuff, um, you know, California, Maryland, I should say, not California on the West Coast, <laughs> not that, but um, in Maryland, uh, we do have a California. Uh, yeah, so, and we also have a Flintstone in Maryland. Did you know that? The Flintstones, the Flintstones, and that's so weird. And we have a Hollywood, we have a Hollywood as well, but that's over there in College Park, Maryland, and there's an area called Hollywood. Yeah, but anyways, whoo, girl, that wind is whipping up. Okay, I'm going to do a separate chat about what's going on outside. Let's go ahead and get into this thrifty goodness. Now I've hit jackpot going thrifting. Um, go check out my other thrift store hauls that I've released within the past week or two. I have a whole bunch of really good, amazing Dollar Tree haul finds. I am setting up for my plus size Shein try on haul that's coming up in a couple of days. Um, I'm setting it up downstairs. I have to actually set things up and um, I'm going to have a Timu haul and some more Shein goodies. Okay. I probably got like two or three videos, actually four videos for Shein. All right. So let's get into this. I found this. This is the bake shop by Masterclass and they had this there and it was $2 and it's beautiful. I'm mean, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. You would think we lived in Tuscany. It's beautiful. Absolutely. And look at, look at the edges. I mean, this is just like a piece of art. And then it's like this beautiful, taupey, off-white, creamy number. It's absolutely gorgeous. So it's going to be um, a lovely addition to my kitchen and serving up meals. And when my husband cooks and I cook and we're trying to make things look a little bit more special, you know, whenever you have a beautiful, um, a piece of, uh, you know, serving wear, it makes such a big difference, um, with presentation, honestly, and even just cutting things up and putting them in here as well. It's just, I loved it. And they had a lot of really lovely pieces, but this is the one that I picked. Yeah. That's the one I picked. I'm trying to see a safe place to put this so it doesn't break. Give me a second. I'm trying to, okay. I think it'll be safe right there. Okay. Then I was looking for photo albums. Photo albums can be very, very, very expensive. And uh, I do uh, scrapbooking. I do with, with my photos and what have you. And I also like to keep my ephemera. Um, you know, I do. So I found these and they're both the same. I got two of them. They're both the same. And I like the fact that they say dream, believe, home, united. Uh, I love that. Really pretty. And then you open it up. It has this almost, um, it looks, you know, uh, like, like a mixed media. It looks grungy, which I love. Then you have your pages here. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is perfect. This is exactly what I need. And you guys, for $2 each, they're both identical. I got them both. And this is perfect that if I decide to leave it on a table or something downstairs, this is my genre, country, rustic. This is, this is my jam right here for my home. If you guys know the type of things that I buy and the things that I like, this is, this is it. That's my jam. So let me put this right here. All right. The next thing I found was this little number. Okay. And I don't know. It doesn't say who's it by or anything, but it was $4, four bucks. 
and it's round and it's like made out of felt and it's like a cute little circle made out of felt with all these little cute little pom-poms it's just the most cutest loveliest little little number i absolutely adore this i mean i adore this this is so stinking cute and they only had one piece and it was where the purses were and i took it because it's just so pretty yeah it's just so pretty so i got that i did i got that now i have more to share with you but before i share the rest of my thrift store goodness i did go to hobby lobby and i bought three things less than five dollars I bought this 50% um, off originally $3.99, part of the fairy tale jewelry department. But I'm going to add this to my keys. Okay, so there you go. But you can put this on your journals and what have you too. But I really wanted it for my keys. And then I did buy um, the paper studio. These were 40 or 50% off. Um, these are normally $2.49. Um, for my hobby, Dollhouse Miniatures 112 scale. And they had these picture frames on sale. And these were like the last two that they had. And they're actually made out of like, you know, some type of resin or something. They're really beautiful. Yeah. And they're perfect for dollhouse miniatures. So I took the last two that they had. Yeah. They were on the little hooky thing. Okay. Back to the thrifty goodness. I know it's, it just wasn't even worth doing a whole haul for it. It's like, I bought two things and I left. That's what happens sometimes. You just don't find stuff. Okay, now towards my home, this was $3. I am trying to move into the direction of doing things for my home and um, make it a little bit more earth friendly whenever at all possible. I mean, it's not always possible. You know, I don't, I'm not like, I'm trying to reduce my footprint. No, I'm not doing all that. But, um, you know, I recycle and I do my thing. I do my thing. So I'm trying to, yeah. Bring in some linens like this. So when we, you know, have our dinners and what have you, we can use these instead, wash them and reuse them. Okay. When at all possible. Okay. So this was 10, 10 and we are a family of six. So keep that, you know, keep that in the back of your head. We're a family of six. We go through some things. Um, three bucks. And I like the fact that this lent it itself beautifully to um winter with the gray the cranberry color um and also fall i thought it was just so pretty for that time so there you go you got yourself some table napkins girl is that what you're trying to say just say it just say it i got some fabrics these were 95 cents now this one it has the designer's information here. It says here, it's by Chris, Kim, Chris, Chris, I'm without words today. I'm really struggling today. I just, I'm not myself. I don't feel good. And I need to crawl into bed. Like I said in my other video, <laughs> I'm sitting here doing this. Okay. This is by Kim. Chris, Christo person, Chris, I don't know, um, of Kimber Bell Designs of Maywood Studio. All right. That was a lot. I should have just showed it to you. There you go. So it's this really beautiful pattern. Um, it was 95 cents for all of this. It's nice, big piece. And I thought it was just so pretty. Um, I can uh, make lots and do lots of different things with this, not just for my dollhouse miniatures, but for my home. Uh, yeah, I can do things with this. I, just yesterday, I had uh, dropped my daughter off five something in the morning for her job because she doesn't have a car. Uh, so I am the official driver because I need the car to drop off and pick up my other kids as well. So I'm dropping her off at her job and I pick her up. And then I, you know, I stay there with her until she can get in. And as soon as I dropped her off, her manager was late. Everybody was waiting outside. And when they finally showed up like an hour later, 
I was rushing home because that means I had to pick up, I had to wake up my kids within 20 minutes. And I was like, oh man, I forgot. I had to mend my son's winter coat because he ripped it from the armhole, like, like all the way down here. It was like a rip this big. So I was like, mad dash, like sitting there trying to mend his coat. And let me tell you something. Coats are not easy to mend because the outer shell, the cloth, is so tightly knitted and thick that a needle just doesn't want to go through it. And I don't have my sewing machine set up or anything. I like to hand sew. I do have a sewing machine, but I like to hand sew. So I'm sitting on my chair, got my, my thing out, waiting for the alarm to go off to wake them up. And I'm mad dashing trying to get this needle through this coat. It was just crazy that morning. But anyways, I found this one. So this is 95 cents as well. And I think it's by the same designer. No, it's by Lewis and Irene. Thread it with love. It's called Fairy Lights. Fairy Lights. That was the design. So it looks, kind of looks like um, Peter Pan. Look at that. Kind of looks like Peter Pan, right? And the fairy. So there's Peter Pan and the fairy in there. And I thought this was so charming. So, so pretty. Um, and I, again, I can use this for projects, not just my dollhouse miniatures. Yes, that's mainly why I bought it. But I can use it for other things as well. So pretty. 95 cents. Okay. Then this is the last one. And this also was 95 cents. And who's the designer for this one? Um, this is Elizabeth Silver. Okay, and this is called Camelot, Camelot of Fabrics. They have CamelotofFabrics.com. Okay, so this one I did get for my dollhouse miniatures because look, it has like a whole bunch of Thunderbolts. And it is, again, 95 cents and there's a whole bunch of fabric in here. Um, it's and it's 95 cents. It was just, and what I can do with this as well is I can make table napkins out of this as well because the design is kind of just like a fun design. And uh, <laughs> it almost looks, unless you look at it real close, it almost looks like uh, when I first looked at it, I was like, oh, are those leaves? And I was like, no, no, there's thunderbolts. How cool is that? And they're tiny. This is going to be like awesome for like a kid's room or something. Make the curtains, make the pillows, make the blankets out of it. And maybe, um, you know, use a little white uh, for the under blankets and for the back side of it. And yeah. So I was like, this is going to be a cool thing. But I also thought about table napkins with this because it's, it's dark. It's going to hide stains, you know, twofold. But that is everything for this thrifty goodness haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed your visit. Give my video a thumbs up if you can. And I'll talk to y'all later. Subscribe, okay? Bye.